Today's experiment is to test the presence of starch in a leaf. As you can clearly see that I have a green leaf in my hand. I will put this leaf in a beaker containing hot water and we have to heat this sample for at least 5 to 10 minutes. So for this experiment, we need the following materials. We need the tripod stand. We need the split lamp here or you can use candle. This is wire gauze, tripod stand, beaker containing water and now I have immersed the green leaf in it. The other materials which we need or required for this experiment is we have iodine, then the test tube containing ethanol and we have majorly we have taken a green leaf outside from a fresh plant and we need the test tube for it and the dropper. So what is the procedure for this experiment? I just put this green leaf as you can see clearly the change of color in it. It was green now you can see that this chlorophyll we have to kill the chlorophyll which is present in a leaf which gives the green color to the leaf and that is one of the important material for the process of photosynthesis as you can see now clearly how color changes from green to dark green now you can see for three minutes more we can heat the sample after this i have to put this leaf sample in a test tube containing ethanol and we don't have to heat ethanol directly or the flame as it is flammable I have to put the test tube in a beaker containing water therein this will get also a heat and our leaf will also get more decolor once you kept in an ethanol. So with the help of a dropper or I can put more ethanol in the test tube. In my hand I have a test tube, I am putting ethanol in it. My dear students as you can see now all the color has just vanished so initially it was green now you can see that that chlorophyll is lost and you can see the color of the beaker now i will put this sample in a test tube containing ethanol you have to do it slowly need not to injure any cell in it i will put it in the test tube now containing ethanol for three minutes more i will heat the sample so after that, the experiment which I told you initially, we have to test the presence of starch. Like I have a cooked rice here, right? It's white in color, you can see. If I will put a drop of iodine on it, within few seconds of time, this will turn into blue to black color. As now you can see here, iodine, it has a brownish tinge. But once I put some of the this, uh, rice, this cooked rice in a petri dish, now you can see, once I add the iodine in it, now you can see the color change, the rice it turns from white to blue black color. It simply indicates my dear that this cooked rice it contains starch in it. And the same activity we are performing here that in the ethanol I put now this leaf we will boil it for two three minutes and after that I will put iodine drop to the sample and you will see gradually the color it will turn after I, I will put the iodine solution now you can see after putting the iodine solution the sample will change color from the dark green to blue black this indicates the presence of starch. When we boil it, chlorophyll lost. And now I will put some of the iodine solution in it. Then gradually you can see the color change. This will turn from dark green to blue black. I will put off the fire here. And now I will, I will just remove the leaf sample. This is the lab thermometer. You can use here in the lab to check the temperature of the boiled water here or any of the liquid. 
as I am removing this leaf from the ethanol sample you can see here and now I will put iodine solution onto the sample now you can see we are near to complete this experiment as you can see in a color from green now see the color here because we killed the chlorophyll which was present inside it by heating it first in a warm water hot water and then in presence of i kept i put the ethanol once again we heat it for three four minutes and it helps us to kill the uh, chlorophyll in it now with the help of dropper we can add few drops of iodine over it and gradually the color slowly it will change from this to blue black color we have killed the chlorophyll which is which was present inside the leaf so this was today's activity as you can see after five minutes there the sample will change from blue to black as it is visible in the camera it just turned from blue to black and it indicates the presence of starch in it so this is the way and we have to do this experiment likewise